Hi everyone, Simon Harrison here and welcome to my June market wrap. Well firstly, I'm really pleased to announce that the purchase of the Holgate real estate business in Lane Cove a few months ago has gone extremely well. We've welcomed a lot of new clients to the Bell Group and the transition has been seamless. And it really has a lot to do with how the two teams have come together, they've worked really hard to provide greater levels of service and professionalism to both our landlords and to our tenants. Secondly, we had a lot of fun this month supporting some great local community events. For the fifth year in a row, we helped raise funds for the Lane Cove West Public School at their major annual fundraiser. And last week, we supported the Inner Wheel of West Harbour's garden party here in Hunters Hill. That's our fourth year in a row supporting that group, and this year they raised a lot of money for Beyond Blue, and it was great to be involved. Lastly, to the marketplaces surrounding Lane Cove and Hunters Hill. Now it's fair to say that the property market we're in at the moment is shifting around a little bit and we're transitioning from what was the absolute best market we've ever seen back into a normal market. There has been a slight correction in values and we are starting to see a few less buyers at the serious end of the negotiation compared to the same time last year. But there are still buyers purchasing in our marketplace and we are still getting good results for our clients. Last Saturday, the auction clearance rates across Sydney as a whole were circa 55%. As an agency, we had six properties go up for sale and we sold five under the hammer, delivering 83%. Now, there were some really strong prices in there and one in particular was a property in Greenwich that we sold for 5.75. Now, that result under the hammer is the highest auction result ever in Greenwich. Now, that auction result also sits next to an auction record we set back in March for 65 Arabella Street, Longueville, which is the highest sale ever under the hammer in that suburb. So while the marketplace is shifting around a little bit at the moment, and with that comes uncertainty, and in some cases confusion about what's to come, the good news is the areas surrounding Lane Cove and Hunters Hill are remaining resilient. And having sold in great markets, normal markets, and terrible markets over the last 20 years in Sydney, what I know in the current climate is experience really counts. I hope you have a fantastic month, and if you'd like to discuss the market or your own property, please reach out to us. We'll make sure you get the right advice.